Hey, all right, well, I'm so stuck on these dentures because I just, I'm really like feeling stressed out about this whole situation. You guys, when I got the dentures originally, it was, you know, a really bad situation and that's when I relapsed on drugs, but not drugs, but I mean, I relapsed, it is a drug, but I mean, I relapsed on, you know, the pain pills because the teeth pain was, you know, so excruciating. Anyway, so the thing is, you guys, is that I had these eight years. I actually put so much glue. I can't get them out. <laughs> like They're cemented in. But I had these eight years, and it's really, really hard to get used to having dentures, you know, from having teeth. Like, it is a really really hard process like um everything your confidence everything like it's hard because you feel like people know that you have dentures and just feel very insecure for me at least I mean I had them when I was 26 years old like I was a baby anyway so you guys when I started this journey to get a new set of dentures through my insurance which is California insurance um I I just assumed that it would be you know a few pro a few appointments and then boom i had no idea that it would be such a horrible process for me and i have not this has not been easy at all like this has been a very stressful journey so my very first experience i went to the dentist affordable dentures and the first dentist that i met was a very very nice lady and she said oh well you know we're going to work on your bite because when i smile i smile like that and your teeth your front is supposed to be over your bottom but anyway which I don't like that I don't like the way that that looks I don't want it to be over my bottom I want it to be like this I like it like this that's how it's been that's how I want it and that's how my normal teeth were like that they were not over they were just like this anyway so she said we're gonna work on your bite because these are very big for my mouth I, I will um, show you guys the other dentures because I didn't even think about this But the other dentures versus these how small those ones are compared to these like those are huge Difference there's a huge difference anyway So that first person said she was gonna work on my bite. So then when I went back um, They have to do the molds now normally the dentist does the mold well as far as I'm aware, that's normally the dentist does the mold. But in my situation, the other person was doing the mold. And the very first person was a male. And if you guys know anything about my story, I'm not very comfortable with males. You know, it, it's it's not like I can't be. But, you know, I'm not always comfortable with males. It just really depends. I feel like I can read somebody. And I don't know. I just, either way, because of my background, I'm not comfortable with males usually. And this guy was a very tall guy and he had like serious nerve problem because he was shaking so bad and I'll never forget it. He was shaking so bad doing the mold, the wax mold, which I'm not no genius, but I don't think shaking is like that good because, you know, the mold has to be a certain way. So the very first mold didn't even work at all. It was caught. It was poop. It, it was garbage. It couldn't even go in my mouth and nothing it was like totally off they had to redo it and he said oh no no it's because of her and I'm like how is it because of me you're the one shaking anyways I go back see another dentist completely different dentist says a different thing and this happened like maybe six to eight times so every literally every time I went I would see somebody new I think twice I seen the same like um, lady who was the actual owner um, and she was the one who I really liked she said oh we're gonna fix your bite but then every time I'd go back it'd be another person who was like what fix your bite like they had no idea and I was just like oh, <laughs> I don't know I just fucking want new teeth please like ah uh. anyway in the bottom line is it didn't work out medical i signed and once you sign you know that is it they don't care so it was a real big hassle for me to you know get them to do it again a different not the place but a different dentist now i i it i did want to go through that dentist at first but then a new lady came in who was a complete b word and she goes we've already tried to help you and i couldn't explain to her like 
you have tried to help me, but multiple people have tried to help me and nobody is telling me the same information and everybody's doing something different. So she was very rude. We've tried to help you already. And it seems like we just can't satisfy you. When that's not the case, it's not that I can't be satisfied. It's that you people are telling me different information each time. You guys are contradicting. One person says they want to fix my bite. The other person says we don't care. Just fucking put these in and like that's it. Bye. You know. Anyways. And it sucks because they really did do a really good job on the, the set of teeth. And I ended up really liking those teeth. But they weren't willing to work with me to make those teeth fit. Anyway. You guys. So I go back to the same dentist that I first went through um, when I first got these done in, you know, eight years ago. And there was two dentists that I worked with. And so I don't, I don't know, but all I know is I did the try-in, all that. I didn't like the try-in. I told the guy, I said, I really don't like the teeth. He said, no, 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 the teeth are good. Don't compare. And I tried to explain to him. Like, I got nervous immediately because that's my biggest problem is, you know, and I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. I can be confrontational with certain people, but with other people, I'm like, mm, scared and shit. So, when he said that, I said, well, I want them to look like my regular teeth, like my real teeth. And I tried to show him a picture, but he said, no, 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 you know, really loud, and it scared me, and he's not. It, I, I really don't blame the dentist, you guys. I'm not saying, like, he's a bad person or anything at all. I'm just saying, in his mind, I think he thought I was questioning his work. And I was. And I was just saying, I don't like your work on me. I want my fucking teeth to look like these teeth. And that's it. So he said, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you know, he got all mad. And then I'm like, you know, then I get more scared. And then I'm like, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. And I signed the paper. I signed the paper, so it's my fault. So anyways... That dentist is willing to do my teeth for eleven hundred dollars. Top five hundred, bottom five hundred, and then a hundred cash for their work. Which it's like twenty five seventy nine for the actual dentures. So I like I said yesterday, you guys, I, I am gonna try to do that. But I mean there's a really big part of me that does want to just go through the affordable dentures. The only thing about the affordable dentures is is they are a fast lab. As far as I know, they are fast. You know, they do things fast. So I feel like it may be a rushed process, but ultimately if I have the money, I want to go to affordable dentures. Like, you know, but at the same time, I I mean it's more money. I don't know. Ultimately, I'm going to go to the, the, my eyes like twitching all crazy, sorry. Ultimately, oh God. Ultimately, you guys, I'm going to go to the cheaper place. But I am going to, like, I am going to talk to them. And I'm supposed to meet the different dentist. And that's next Tuesday. And so my plan is, which... God, let's pray I don't have any freaking appointments because I now I have no teeth besides these teeth and I don't want to wear these because these, these don't break. Like, you guys, I, I wanted to show you so bad, but I'm so ashamed and, like, it's embarrassing. But I have sores all on my mouth now and it's really painful. Like, I didn't have sores that bad like that and now they're really bad. So it's like, dude... It is crazy. I mean, it looks like there's something in my mouth, like, shooting up. I don't know how to explain it, but it's really weird looking. <laughs> it looks like my bone is poking through or something weird. It doesn't look good at all. Um, but I'm supposed to go back there, and so, like, if I have the money, I would rather go to the fucking more expensive place because I just feel like those might be a better quality. You know what I mean? I'm not, like, trying to blink, but my eyes must up. But... I don't know. I mean, if I can do both, that would be, like, my goal. Like, if I could do both, that would be ideal because, you know, really these don't work. So these really are not a backup set because they don't fit. Yes, I'm using them, but they truly don't fit. Like, they really don't fit me. They fall out. And I'm using crazy amounts of polygrip, and you're really not supposed to be using polygrip for life. I don't think it's meant to be a lifelong thing. Anyways, you guys, I just wanted to tell you guys about that. I'm kind of stressed out about it. I've watched so many different denture journeys. And you guys, some of these people's teeth look so freaking good. They look so real. I mean, you got to think about it right now. There's so many people getting veneers. And so veneers, you know, you really can't tell. Those are fake teeth. Those are not real teeth. They're fake teeth, you know. 
and um they of course they're way more money but anyway there's so many people getting the veneers right now you guys so i just really wish that i could have a good pair of dentures that i really enjoy wearing and i'm happy to smile and i'm proud of you know and I feel like if those other teeth would not be so off and crooked, I wouldn't mind them as much, but they're so crooked that I don't like them. And either way, these are big teeth, but at the same time, I don't know because I feel like all my kids have the same size big teeth. So it's annoying because, you know, it's annoying. When you have teeth, and you lose weight, your teeth don't shrink, okay? They don't. Your teeth are not gonna shrink because you shrunk. Your, your bones might shrink, but not your teeth themselves. Your teeth are the same no matter what, right? Like, right? And these teeth are a mold of my teeth. Therefore, I don't think that these teeth are too big. I think th these teeth are reasonable that they could just shrink the freaking gums. That's what I think. Because if you look at my pictures, my teeth were big. I had big teeth. Like, I didn't have little skinny tiny baby teeth. And to me, those other teeth are too small. But then, you guys, I have messed up vision. I don't know. Maybe it's not good. I don't know. You know, like, I have not... I don't know. <laughs> like, I'm not good, you know. Anyways... I'm going to show you guys the cookies that I just made right now, you guys. I just made my bed, and it looks so beautiful. Like, you know, I actually, actually, it's going to go dark, but I actually, um, it's going to go super dark, but I actually just, um, what was I talking about? Hold on, I forgot what I was going to say. I just, um, oh my gosh, you guys, what was I going to say? I can't remember, but anyways, take a good look at my house because it's nice and beautiful before my kids come destroy everything. My little fish is so freaking cute. And that fish is actually such a good fish, you guys. And look, I don't like that filter, though. I really don't. Red! Hi, Red! I know. I'm such a good namer. Red! Anyways, I can't fucking... I ain't freaking... Hi, Red! What... There you are! Oh, you're so beautiful! Hi! You're so beautiful. Yeah, you are. Look at you. Hi, baby. Oh, my goodness. I love you. My fish talks is, is hearing me. I fully believe it. I do. I know. Maybe you think I'm crazy. I am crazy, but you guys take a good look because guess what? It's not going to stay like this. I'm going to, um like, you know. Oh, I should water my plant. I need to do that, but it looks so cute. It looks so good, and then boom. Like, it's so nice and clean, and my kids are going to ruin everything. I know it. I know it. I just know it. Anyway, it's just like, yes, I do window because I don't like people looking in. Anyway, that's another video. You guys, these are little cookies. And they look so cute, right? Anyways, hold on one sec. These ones look a little thicker, but... So, basically, I made the cookies, and I literally went all out. Like, I'm so sad because... And when I say all out, I mean all out, but I mean, you know, I made all these different colored frostings, purple and yellow and orange and blue and green and black and white. I made all of the colors, you guys. I went and I got like different types of sprinkles and decorations and guess what? And I made chalupas with rice and beans. And I haven't finished the chalupa shells yet, but everything else is done. And guess what? Nevaeh's friend, mom, just texted and said she can't come today because she got sick. And Nevaeh is going to literally freak out. She has autism, and so she doesn't do well with cancellations. Like, she really will start freaking out. So I'm so sad. I feel so bad. I'm going to go buy her, like, um, something that's local here, a treat, because I know she's just going to be devastated. I'm serious. Like, kids... I don't know, but anyways, autism kiddos do not, like, for me, my kiddo does not handle, you guys, oh my god, my phone was like, okay, that was weird, anyways, autism kiddos, um, do not, my kiddo does not do well with cancellations, and I mean at all, I mean, she will literally go berserk, and I mean 
buzzer, okay? So just pray for me. Just pray. Please pray for me. I'm, I'm a little nervous. I really am because I already know I'm going to be like, honey, you know, she got sick and she's not feeling good. Like, <laughs> what? Anyways, I don't want to reenact it. I'm not trying to make fun of her. I'm just saying, like, it's going to be a lot. <laughs> pray for me. I'm scared. Anyways, but you guys, my printer is broken. My sublimation printer. And I'm freaking so pissed off. Like, I spent fucking $300 and it don't even work. I made a shirt yesterday. And then it's supposed to be, you know, pumpkin-y colors and shit. And as soon as I made the shirt, I made Mia and Nevaeh both, you know, the mama mini one. And then, boom. Like, it's like error, printer, you know, no, it won't fucking print. So I'm like, what? Why? And, yeah, it's just a big old hassle. Anyways, you guys, I'm going to go. I hope that you guys have a really good rest of your guys' day. God bless you. Have a good weekend. Um, Either way, I was going to make the cookies and decorate the cookies with the kids. I had one platter just for Nevaeh and her friend and then one platter for Nico and Mia because I'm not going to make them miss out as much as she wants me to but anyways i'm gonna end up going and taking nico to go get a haircut today i got that for them to do making the cookies which if you guys know me i always do stuff like that for the kids but also i'm going to do a craft with the kids and like i had on i had a plan to do a craft with nico and mia like separately because you know i got crafts for nevaeh to do with her friend by herself so i'm just gonna save those ones um anyway I got little eyeballs and a whole bunch of cool little things, so the kids are going to be so excited. Anyways, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Please wish me luck on this horrible denture journey because I'm sad. I'm sad. All right, bye.